Human Anatomy for Kids, Essential Organs and Skeleton. Hello, amazing explorers. Welcome to another exciting journey with Wiggle Giggle Kids TV. Today, we're going inside the human body to learn about our essential organs and skeleton. From your brain that helps you think to the bones that help you stand, your body is like a superhero team. Each part has an important job. So, grab your Explorer goggles, it's time for a body adventure. Part 1. The Brain. Your Control Center. Let's start at the top with your brain. Your brain is the boss of your body. It lives inside your skull and controls everything you do, like thinking, talking, moving, feeling emotions, even blinking and breathing without you noticing. The brain has three main parts. Cerebrum. For thinking and memory is divided into four lobes. Frontal lobe, located at the front of the brain, it's involved in reasoning, planning, and voluntary movement. Parietal lobe. Located behind the frontal lobe, it processes sensory information like touch, temperature, and pain. Temporal lobe. Located on the sides of the head, it's involved in hearing, memory, and language processing. Occipital lobe. Located at the back of the head, it processes visual information. Cerebellum for balance and movement. Brainstem, for things you do without thinking, like your heartbeat. Fun fact, your brain has around 100 billion neurons, tiny messengers that send signals faster than a race car. Part 2. The Heart. Your body's pump. Your heart goes thump-thump every moment of your life. It's a strong muscle about the size of your fist and it never takes a break. What does it do? Pumps blood all around your body carries oxygen and nutrients to every cell, helps you stay alive and active. Your heart has four chambers. Right atrium, receives oxygen-poor blood from the body. Right ventricle, pumps oxygen-poor blood to the lungs. Left atrium, receives oxygen-rich blood from the lungs. Left ventricle, pumps oxygen-rich blood to the body and is connected to blood vessels like tiny roads called veins and arteries. Fun fact, your heart beats about 100,000 times a day. That's a lot of thumping. Part 3. The Lungs. Breathe in, breathe out. Take a deep breath. Your lungs are doing their job. You have two lungs, right lung and left lung, inside your chest, and it consists of right bronchi and left bronchi act as air passageway to the lungs. Diaphragm, the primary muscle of respiration which facilitates breathing by contracting and relaxing. Trachea, the windpipe which provides airflow for respiration. When you breathe in, air travels through your windpipe into tiny sacs called alveoli where the magic of gas exchange happens. Fun fact, your lungs are so stretchy they can hold over a gallon of air. Part 4. The Liver The Body's Lab Say hello to your liver, your body's chemistry lab. Your liver cleans your blood, stores energy like sugar, makes bile to help digest fats. It's your body's biggest internal organ and it works 24-7. The liver has two main lobes, a smaller left lobe and a larger right lobe, coronary ligament, and a gallbladder. Part 5. The Stomach. The Food Breaker. Yum. After you eat, your food goes into your stomach. The stomach is a stretchy, muscular bag that stores the food, breaks food down using strong juices, mixes it up into a mushy soup, sends it to the intestines to finish the job. Your tummy might make growling sounds. Don't worry, it's just hard at work. Food and liquid passes from your throat to your stomach through the hollow muscular tube called esophagus. Part 6. The Pancreas The Sugar Balancer Right next to the stomach is the pancreas, a small organ with a big job. The pancreas Makes insulin to help your body use sugar for energy. Sends juices to your stomach to help digest food. It's like a helper robot that keeps your sugar levels just right. Part 7. The Intestines 
the food finishers. Let's slide down to the intestines, your body's twisty tubes. There are two parts, large intestine, shorter but wider. It takes out the water and forms waste to exit your body. Small intestine, super long and skinny. It absorbs all the nutrients from your food. Your intestines can be over 20 feet long, longer than a giraffe's neck. Part 8. The Kidneys. The Body's Filters. Now let's check out your kidneys. You have two. These bean-shaped organs work like super filters. They clean your blood, remove waste and extra water. Make urine, which leaves your body through your bladder. The key components are the renal medulla, which secrete urine, and the renal pelvic, which moves urine out of the kidney. You pee thanks to your hardworking kidneys. Part 9. The Skeleton. Your body's frame. Stand tall and wave your arms. Thank your skeleton for that. Your skeleton holds up your body, protects your organs, like the skull protects your brain, helps you move with joints and muscles. There are 206 bones in your body. Types of bones. Skull, protects your brain. Clavicle, your collarboners. Rib cage, protects your heart and lungs. Arms, help you move. Spine, backbone, keeps you upright. Pelvis, holds everything in place. Legs, help you walk. Fun fact, your bones are super strong. Some are even stronger than steel. Wow, your body is like a busy city with organs doing amazing things all day long. From your thinking brain to your pumping heart to your helpful bones, you're a walking wonder. Thanks for joining us on this body adventure in kids learning. More fun episodes are coming soon, where we'll explore anatomy of cell, types of cells, types of organ failures, and more. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe so you never miss a beat with Wiggle Giggle Kids TV.